Hi there, this is Wendy coming to you with another video. Um, I've been crafting up a storm and I'm involved in lots of swaps that I have to actually get mailed out ASAP. I'm much better at making the things for swaps than I am getting them mailed out. And so um, this is all going to be mailed out to one particular lady. Um, I made a really sparkly, um, I guess a holiday card. It's blank on the inside. Meant to be more seasonal. Uh, didn't want to use kind of typical Christmassy type colors, but at least it kind of gives the idea of winter, I think. And lots of recycling using scraps. Um, so there's that. And there's this little card, which is, again, meant to be kind of a holiday sort of theme with a tree that I made out of a tea bag. Um, just kind of holiday colors and things, but not typical red and green. I'm including some gold doilies that I got at a thrift store that I thought she might enjoy. I'm including a part of a paper pad that I got from Target and just because, I guess. Um, and I made a couple of tags. I made this smaller tag. Um, again, non-traditional colors, kind of a gold and aqua type color, but still has a snowflake, so I think it still works. And then there's this bigger version with a paper snowflake, and then again, some little Dollar Tree snowflakes. And the main purpose behind the swap for this particular individual is that it is a flip book. Um, and it was supposed to be a winter theme flip book. So this is the flip book, it says Hello Winter. And basically, again, not really what you're supposed to do, but I kind of always do whatever I want to do. There's some, um, oh, some little tidbits in here. And I included a couple of paper bag pockets that again have little treats in them. This cute canceled Arctic Fox um, stamp. There's this card that flips up and I included some tags in it. Uh, this pocket which also has goodies in it. And then this which, uh, this house I got as a pack of cards that were We've moved cards at the thrift store, and the house is actually a bright yellow, and so I went ahead and went over it with some dollar store markers and just made it kind of more in a color scheme that was suitable for what I was doing. And then if we go the opposite way, um, on this side, um, we have a little pocket, and there's some little tags here. These are clock post-it notes, more post-it notes here, so kind of a planner theme. More post-it notes, and an envelope that has some washi and some, some other stuff in it. Um, so yeah, that's the winter book that I'm going to go ahead and send out hopefully today, and I hope my partner likes it. And then the last thing, and I guess I'll just piggyback this onto this particular video, I wanted to share some uh, pocket letters that I'm going to send out. And the first is to my partner, Sonia Knoll. And I saw on her, I guess on her Facebook page, or just some pocket letters she was sharing, and it didn't seem like she was really into the whole <laughs> Christmas theme. And so I saw she was working on some kind of more spring-type colors, and so I made one for her in those colors and so this is what I made for her there's a little bit of a glare there but um, as always lots of tidbits um, butterflies and owls and leaves and flowers trees um, try to just kind of stay in that kind of spring theme and then as far as goodies I just um, <laughs> actually went through the 
pocket letters that I've gotten from people and took out some kind of color theme related things. And then this is an ATC that I made. Um, so that's really my own little artistic twist. So I'm going to send that off. And then the next pocket letters are kind of a series of Christmas themed pocket letters. We have this one, which is kind of in the burgundies and deeper greens, and I tried to make it kind of vintage-y um, in nature. Just using lots of stamps, canceled stamps, and um, tags, things that people have sent me. Um, and on the other side, some rhinestones. I included some die cuts with projects I've been making lately. Um, some um, confetti, um, washi, just lots of little tidbits that I thought somebody might enjoy. And then this one is also meant to be kind of holiday, but again, kind of non-traditional, no red, no green. Um, so I did a snowflake and see in a Christmas stamp, I have this little deer that's got some snow on the bottom. Um, so again, um, kind of holiday-ish, but not. And then the goodies on the back, again, are kind of just gold and silver and nothing really Christmassy, but obviously with that intent. And then finally I did a, um, a Christmas pocket letter that is in the more bright colors that I've been working on for the... I just did some flip books, altered books that were in this kind of lime green, bright red kind of color scheme. So I kept on with that and just kind of used up little tidbits. I've been making these little houses and these card candies. Um, tried to use up some of those. And then that's the back with the goodies. So lots of fun stuff to share. Oh, what I was going to say, these are from Michael's. <laughs> They were 50% discount, I don't know, maybe a summer ago. And they're these cute little veneer wood hangers that had little banners, and I just covered mine and put a Christmas stamp on it. I thought that was super cute. So anyway, thank you for letting me share these projects with you, and I think I have a few more videos before Christmas, because um, I have been crafting like crazy. Um, I've been kind of stressed out and not feeling well, and so this has been kind of my mellowing out time. So thank you for watching and look for some new videos here in the next day or two. Thank you. Hope you're doing well. Bye-bye.